بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سٹوڈنٹس لاسٹ لیکچر میں ہم نے جیسا کہ آپریٹرز کے بارے میں ڈسکس کیا تھا دیر آر ٹو ٹائپس آف آپریٹرز یونری آپریٹرز اینڈ بائنری آپریٹرز ان یونری آپریٹرز دیر از اونلی اے سنگل آپرینٹ اینڈ ان بائنری آپرینٹس دیر آر ان بائنری آپریٹرز دیر آر ٹو آپرینٹس سو ناؤ وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس سم آپریٹرز ون ٹائپ آف آپریٹرز از ارتھمیٹک آپریٹرز آل آف یو مسٹ نو اباؤٹ دیز آپریٹرز دا ارتھمیٹک آپریٹرز انکلوڈ ایڈیشن سبٹریکشن ملٹیپلیکیشن ڈویژن اینڈ ماڈولس ہیئر آر دا سمبلس آف ایچ آپریٹر ایکچولی وٹ از ایڈیشن وٹ از سبٹریکشن ملٹیپلیکیشن آل دیز آر دا آپریشنس and these operations are performed on some data or you can say these operations are performed on some operands arithmetic operators are the binary operators and uh, here must include two operands for the operation as addition is the operation so there must be two operands that can be added and the symbol used for the addition is plus and this symbol plus is actually the operator and the working of this operator is to add the two operands like this subtraction multiplication division and modulus all have different symbols and these symbols are actually the operators and all these operators are the arithmetic operators and these are arithmetic operators are basically binary operators so uh, everyone knows addition adds values subtraction subtracts values multiplication multiplies two operands and division divides two uh, integer values or the two uh, values uh, modulus modulus is uh, actually uh, operator which gives the remainder of division of two integers or two values جب دو ویلیوز کو ڈیوائڈ کرتے ہیں تو یہ ریمائنڈر ہمیں رزلٹ میں دیتا ہے سو ہیئر وی کین سی دیٹ ہاؤ وی کین یوز دا ارتھمیٹک آپریٹرز ان پروگرامنگ ہیئر یو کین سی دیٹ دیر آر ٹو ویریبلس اے اینڈ بی اے ہیز ویلیو ٹین اینڈ بی ہیز ویلیو فائیو اور یو کین سی that a is assigned with value 10 and b is assigned 5 value this is the assignment operator uh, in programming this single equal sign shows the assignment operator for the equality there must be two equal signs um, together to show the equality here it is the assignment operator and the working of assignment operator is that that the value must exist on the right side of the operator and uh, the variable where uh, the value is going to be assigned must be on the left side so uh, the value on the right side is assigned to the variable on the left side here we can see that a contains 10 and b contains 5 when we are using these operations like a plus b it means what is the value inside a that is 10 and what is the value inside b that is 5 so we will uh, we will add them and the result will be shown as the 15 uh, this plus sign actually performs the operation of addition like this if we discuss a multiplied by b then what is the value inside a that is the 10 and what is the value inside b that is 5 so these values are multiplied together and gives the result 50 if we talk about the a modulus b then it means 10 uh, modulus 5 it means uh, 5 uh, to the 10 so there is no remainder so remainder is 0 uh, these are the arithmetic operators uh, which we can uh, discuss more by doing some examples uh, and you people must know about the arithmetic operators and, uh, and their implementation uh, uh, here it is not necessary that variable name uh, will always be a and b and the value will always be 10 or 5 it may differ it may be x or y and the values may be different like 6 or 7 uh, 
etc anything must be happy so uh, you people must know here that there are arithmetic operators like addition subtraction multiplication division and modulus you must know their symbols and the implementation and you also must know that this is the binary operator uh now we will discuss the assignment statement as we discussed previously that assignment operator is actually a single equal sign uh, as uh, you have used uh, uh, in previous uh, conditions like equal sign is uh, the two parallel lines but this time this time in programming this uh, equal sign is actually the assignment operator assignment operator has the quality that it will assign the value which is written on the right side in the into the variable which is written on the left side this is the syntax this is the syntax of assignment statement and the syntax is actually uh, the way of writing some code or uh, uh, some language in the programming language so syntax is actually the grammar or any rule which we are going to follow um so you can see here the syntax of assignment operator that is the variable and then the assignment operator and then expression here may be some expression here may exist some value and at the end the semicolon this semicolon is very important you people must uh, include the semicolon at the end of the Uh, any code of assignment statement and uh, this semicolon uh, contains one uh, dot and one comma okay if you don't uh, put this semicolon at the end of the statement then there will be a error in the execution of program and if uh, you put the expression on the left side and the variable on the right side then there will be also be a, an error so you people must follow the syntax that is variable assignment operator and expression expression may be some variable or maybe some constant values variable means uh, another value variable like x y z or it may be some constant value so uh, must be careful to implement this code here you can see the example of uh, assignment statement where first in first line a is the variable and 100 is the constant value so 100 is assigned to the a variable and in the second statement you can see there is a variable c a and b so the result of a plus b will be assigned to the c all these are variables and you can see that a plus b is actually expression this is the combination of more than one variable so we can see uh, we can say that this is the expression and the result of this expression uh, must be assigned to the c variable and you can see that there is the expression like uh, the subtraction of these two variables subtraction c minus d actually uh, uh, the subtraction occurs between the values which are uh, contained in c and d so uh, um, for example there is a value on uh, 10 in the c and uh, 8 in the d so the result will be the 2 and 2 plus 2 uh, 10 uh, will be 12 and 12 will be assigned to the x so this is the assignment operators and uh, uh, assignment operator is doing the assignments of values and constant values and variables to the left side existing variables so uh, now we will discuss the relational operators first of all we will uh, we discussed uh, uh, arithmetic operators then we discuss assignment operator and now we are going to discuss the relational operators as the name says that a uh, relational operators are actually uh, operators which are relative to the values these are relative to the values how uh, actually this is a uh, a conditional operator here uh, you compare the two values and the result may be true or false there is no third option when the comparison occurs then it must be produced uh, some uh, true or false result uh, so 
the conditional operator or comparison operators are also called relational operators so uh, uh, in exams it may be asked by the names of conditional operators it may be asked by the names of comparison operators or it may be asked by the relational operators so if you have studied well then uh, you people will not be confused and uh, if uh, you are uh, lack in your studies then then there must be a confusion and you you may not be able to write anything so uh, if we talk about the relational operator then the conditional and comparison operators are the same they compare the two values and the result may be true or false not both results may occur uh, simultaneously okay one condition may be true or one condition may be false at a time so here are the some symbols of operators like this is the greater than operator this is the less than operator this is the equal equal to this is the equal to and this is the greater than and equal to and this is the less than equal to these are the some operators which you can see here and the last one is not equal to the sign of exclamation and then the assignment operator it means not equal to all these are relational operators so uh, in mathematics you uh, people must use these operators like greater than less than and uh, equal to greater than equal to less than equal to and not equal to these are the relational operators so now we discuss the relational expression uh, the relational expression is actually an expression which contains some uh, relational operators here we can see some examples like uh, 100 is greater than 15 is it true or false it may be true or it may be false nothing third option exists and at a time it may be only true or it may be only false both conditions cannot be result uh, resulted together so 100 is greater than 15 yes this is true 25 is less than 5 false 30 is less than equal to 12 in this case if there is 30 on the right side then it will be true because equal is also exist here 30 is less than equal to 12 false 40 is greater than equal to 20 true now this is not equal to not equal to sign so uh, a and b the values of a and b will be assigned as key values will be assigned here and the comparison results true or false so 0 is greater than equal to 0 here we can see yes true 0 is equal to 0 you will forget about the greater sign if there exists a uh, greater than equal to it means if both sides contain the same values then it will be the true value 0 is less than equal to 0 uh, less than equal means it may be less than or it may be equal so there exists an or relationship so there is uh, 0 is equal to 0 that is true 1 is not equal to 2 yes this is true 1 is not equal to 2 so all these are the relational operators and um, relational operators like this comparison operators and uh, on the whole this is a relational expression